Hello people, um, in my last couple videos, or one of, a few of my last videos, I did a Shopify video for debut theme, and in that video, people were saying that they were having problems with the venture theme, so I just want to um, create this video real quick to show you guys how to edit that, because I was able to change the background on this, let me show you guys what I'm talking about, see I was able to change the background for the venture theme, it was it took a while but it was pretty simple um yeah so let's get into it all right so first get your image if you don't have an image you can go to like pexels.com really cool website to get some free images they got some nice stuff on here um but back to this so for this all you have to do is the following Give me one second. Okay. So first we're gonna make a duplicate. Or you know what? We're not gonna make a dupe. Uh nah, I'll just go through it. Cause if I make a duplicate, it's just gonna have the background on it anyway. Okay. Well, we'll just go on this. Edit code. So we should be in the edit code section. I'm just waiting for this to load up. Um close you can close these folders because we're just going to be working with the assets folder you'll click on themes dot scss dot liquid and you will also upload your image too. I already uploaded mine it's called image one dot jpeg you're going to do the same and from there we're going to um, for me I've had to put it in a certain spot so you can um click inside this and then on your keyboard you want to press control right in the bottom left hand corner control and then F control and F and it's going to bring up this search bar and the search bar you can just type um, dot page container oh I spelled it wrong okay and from here you can just press the arrow down what is a hyphen in there too dot page hyphen container and then you just want to keep going keep going okay right here under page container is going to be under the drawer theme styles so you're going to go under this and under this page container section you're going to type in this code this code should be in the description so you can just copy and paste it and um, if you don't want to have a background and you just want to change the color, let me get a HTML color real fast. We're going to make it a blue background. So this should be like um, color content or something. It should be something different. You shouldn't have a color here at under background color. But if you just wanted to change the background color this is what it should look like it should be background color um, hashtag then the color and then you just click save and I'm gonna go back to the website I'm gonna refresh and it should change to a blue background yeah see so if you want a plain black plain background like that that's just a solid color you can just do that piece of code or if you want to have an image in your background you're gonna have to do this copy this code background image URL post, um, parentheses and then bracket bracket image one dot jpeg and then the remaining amount but like I said this is in the description you could just copy it in the description and um, then you would just save and this is under the drawer theme styles so if you want you can just type in drawer theme styles and it'll take you right here and you scroll down a little bit to page dot page container and then add it right in and then from there since I saved it just gotta refresh the page I mean you got your background and then from there you can just um, if you know more coding that you want to add you can just do it all right here. 
Um, I hope this video was able to help you. Thanks for watching and let me know if there's another free theme that you want me to work on and show you how to do stuff with. All right. Take care, guys.